Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for January 20th, read by Craig M. from Denny, Scotland. A thoughts for the day. Communication. From the beginning, communication in AA has been no ordinary transmission of helpful ideas and attitude. Because of our kinship in suffering and because our common means of deliverance are effective for ourselves only when constantly carried to others, our channels of contact have always been charged with the language of the heart, as Bill sees it, pages 195. Thought to consider. Listening feeds the spirit. Acronyms. Dead. Drinking ends all dreams. Just for today. Obedience. Tradition 1. Our common welfare should come first. Personal recovery depends upon AA unity. Every newcomer, every friend who looks at AA for the first time is greatly puzzled. They see liberty virgin on license, yet they recognise at once that AA has an irresistible strength of purpose and action. The AA member has to conform to the principles of recovery. His life depends upon obedience to the spiritual principles. 12 Steps and 12 Traditions, pages 129 to 130. Daily Reflections. We pause and ask. As we go through the day, we pause when agitated or doubtful and ask for the right thought or action. Alcoholics Anonymous, is page 87. Today I humbly ask my higher power for the grace to find the space between my impulse and my action, to let flow a cooling breeze when I would respond with heat, to interrupt fierceness with gentle peace, to accept the moment which allows judgment to become discernment, to defer to silence when my tongue would rush to attack or defend. I promise to watch for every opportunity to turn toward my higher power for guidance. I know where this power is. It resides within me. As clear as a mountain brook hidden in the hills, it is an unsuspected inner resource. I thank my higher power for this world of light and truth. I see when I allow it to direct my vision. I trust it today and hope it trusts me to make all effort to find the right thought or action today. As Bill sees it, light from a prayer. God grant us his serenity to accept the things we cannot change, the courage to change the things we can, and the wisdom to know the difference. We treasure our serenity prayer because it brings a new light to us that can dissipate our old time and near fatal habit of fooling ourselves. In the radiance of this prayer, we see that defeat, rightly accepted, need be no disaster. We now know that we do not have to run away, nor ought we again try to overcome adversity by still another bulldozing power drive that can only push up obstacles before us faster than can be taken down. It's from Grapevine, March 1962. Big Book Quote If, when you honestly want to, you find you cannot quit entirely, or if when drinking you have little control over the amount you take, you are probably alcoholic. If that be the case, you may be suffering from an illness which only a spiritual experience will conquer. It's from Alcoholics Anonymous, We Agnostics, page 44. 24 hours a day. A thought for the day. In AA, we're all through with lying, hangovers, remorse and wasting money. When we were drinking, we were only half alive. Now that we're trying to live decent, honest, unselfish lives, we're really alive. Life has a new meaning for us, so that we can really enjoy it. We feel that we're some use in the world. We're on the right side of the fence instead of the wrong side. We can look the world in the face instead of hiding in alleys. We come into A to get sober, and if we stay long enough, we learn a new way of living. Am I convinced that no matter how much fun I got out of drinking, that life never was as good as life I can build in AA? Meditation for the day. I want to be at one with the divine spirit of the universe. I will set my deepest affections on things spiritual, not on things material. As we think, so we are. So I will think of and desire that which will help, not hinder, my spiritual growth. I will try to be at one with God. No human aspiration can reach higher than this. 
Prayer for the day. I pray that I may think love and love will surround me. I pray that I may think health and health will come to me. It's Hazeldean Foundation, PO Box 176, Centre City, MN 55012. This is Transitions Daily. My name's Craig and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc., 1952 through 2001.